All right. So, um, show me that one again. Nice. I'm a last good. So to really find a good rhythm, try not to get, you've got it, you've nailed it. Try not to have that pause now, so just, pull, so just straight into it. Good. Good, soft, yep. soft roll. Nice, nice. A little bit soft oh, right foot. Like if you roll it too far, it's gonna you know, yep. struggle to bring it back. Good, last one. Yeah, beautiful, beautiful. I'm relaxed. Good. Yep. With ball mastery, Good, it's a blow. Much better. You'll find that even now, no, I'm, you know, is it going to be a blow? But we'll get it in. We'll have a break halfway through. Okay. Next one. What we're going to do now? Pull the V. This one's really good. You can actually use this in tight situations. So, found one v one with you in the game. We'll do them too. Opposite football. Found one v one with you in the game. So it's very important that all you're doing is you're slightly opening your hips as well. So what I want you to do with the hot tip I always say to all my players is actually draw the letter V with the ball. So one, two, one, two. So I'm really opening my hips out because you've got to move the ball enough so you're actually going past the player. All right. So start, follow me. So it's opposite foot and right foot. One, two, stop. One, two, stop. Ready to get on the bounce? One. Two, stop. Yep. Good, excellent. Sharper. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, cooking, right. cooking. All right. All this is now you just got to tell your brain yep. to just go opposite foot. Good. So again, stop, stop, in a game, you might be there, and I might go, I might go bang, bang. Yep. So, like yeah. so all I'm doing now, Good, left to right, right to left. Start with the left foot. Good. So now it's, you've got to tell your brain to not let your left foot go there. It's, it's, it's bring it back with the same foot. So start the same as me on the left foot. We'll go slow. It's one, two, three. One, two, three. Good. Try not to lean back. Soft touches with the ball. Ready? One, two, three. One, two, three. Try and keep your foot on it. One, two, three. Ready to go on the bounce? All right, we'll start with the left side again. Ready, three, two, one, play. One, two, three. One, two, three. Good, you show me first. <laughs> A little bit harder, this one. Good. Nice. Move that ball, open the hips. Good. Open the hips. Like bending your knee, beautiful. One, two, three. One, two, three, good. I'm relaxed, so what I want you to do now is have a good look at me in full flow. So you've got the pattern now, but there's a pause there. Now I just don't want to, just want you to get rid of the pause, so it's just... Oh. And that's what can happen. Heavy touch breaks down, so I need to be softer with it. So I'm on the bounce all the time. Open the hips, open the hips, draw in that letter V, alright? Last little practice of that one. Fight, slight bend in your knee. That's it, that's a good rhythm. Good and lucky, again. Play. One, two, three. One, two, three. Good. I'm relaxed. That one, put a little bit more practice in, in your own time because I want to move on. All right? That one's a little bit harder. All right. So that was one we were just doing. Simple, easy, easy. Let's have a look at the next one because we'll do that one too. I think it's a different rhythm. Yeah, it's a different rhythm, different ones, right. So the first one, the first one's pretty simple. You just go in. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Second one's actually a different rhythm. Yeah, so you see it's a different rhythm. So the first one we're gonna do 
is a one, two, three, where we actually don't put our foot down. Right. One, two, again. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. So the first touch, G, is always the inside. One, two, three. Inside, outside, inside. One, two, three. So if you don't take that first touch inside, it's not going to work. So we're working on a bit of balance as well. Yeah, good. Inside, outside, inside. Well done. Get to the side of the ball, otherwise that's what happens. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Good. Let's go synchronised. So we can Try and keep up with my rhythm, okay? So that with your left foot, your left foot, they need a lot of work. Yep. Play. One, two, three. 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 Three. One, two, 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 three. Let's go. Let's go. Good. Three more. That's not bad. Yep. Better. We had, a, we had a stage there where it was good. The reason why I jump in and do it with you as well is you can sort of like, you can see me yep. in the corner of your eye and you can keep up with that rhythm. Brilliant. Different rhythm this time. Side so like bending your knee. It's just going to be yep. one, two, three. Four, switch sides. One, two, three, four. Now this one is different because I start with the outside of my foot. One, two, chop, chop. One, chop, two, chop. You see how I'm getting to the side of the ball? A skill that is used a lot, G. So if I'm with you now, it's a chop. See you later. Outside of my foot. All right, bang. So these are skills that are very basic, but super effective and they get used all the time. So, ready? Go my pace first. Outside, chop. Outside, chop. Let it run across your body. Outside, chop. Outside, chop. Play. Outside, chop. I've been soft with the ball. Yeah. Good. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Love it. Synchronized. We got this. A little bit more space for this one because we've got to shuffle at the same time. We're going to start in that little position there. Good wide stand. Ready? Three, two, one, play. One, two, three, four. 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 Yes, G! You don't want to get in that position there. But breathe. So try mentally say to yourself. Tough? So how many touches of balls do you reckon we've had so far? That's uh, way more. That's what it's about. Just excuse my hair for all the viewers on YouTube. <laughs> Alright, next one. <laughs> so we visualise it first. Oh, one of my favourite. We'll go two at a time. So inside, outside. Yeah, you've watched it, haven't you? You've been on the YouTube before. Right, should be able to gaff this one. Alright, first one. One, two. Chop. Outside, chop, outside. It's pretty similar oh, to what we were just doing. Play. Good. Nice. Easy. Easy. Right, let's go synchronize. You got that one. You got that one. Ready? Start with the right foot inside. Three, two, one. Move the ball, chop the ball. Move it even more now. And relax. So, this time I'm going to challenge you with that one. You really want to beat a player, it has to be moved. So you're going to do it yourself. Thank You've got to go from one side of the square to the other. So you've got to really move the ball. Yep. Chop, touch, chop, well touch. Excellent. Notice right. I'm always in this position, okay? Play. Yep. Start on the outside, sorry for me. Excellent. Go inside your left, big chop across. Play. One, yep. two. One, two, good, chop. Well One, two, move that chop a little bit more. Good, get to the back of the ball, nice. There we go. Good and relax. I want, to I want to fix one thing. You can actually do it quicker. So you're moving the ball here and you're actually running, pretty much getting in line with the ball and then doing it. You can actually stretch your foot and go to the back of it. So you can actually just go bang, bang. See, I'm taking less time to do that. So I'm here and it's just a chop, 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 chop. Back of the ball, up. And you see how I'm actually bending my knee 
So in a game, I can push off and get past the player. Okay? You can utilize your pace then. Play. Big chop. Stretch the foot. Yeah, yeah. Good. Try and go up there. Boom. Big stride into it. Nice, nice. Outside the foot. Much better. Keep it nice and straight. Good. Left side, you always got to touch it with the outside of your foot. Outside your foot now. Inside, outside. Inside, outside. Chop. Inside, outside. Perfect. Relax. Good. Keep going, G. I'm loving it. There's actually two different ways you can do that. You know, there's the there's, there's, there's short version, yeah, where you just keep it nice and close. And then there's the long version where you might have to beat a player. Okay, we're going to skip that one. It's just a double tap. You'll fly through that one. Easy. Oh, yeah. Now we're, going. Now we're talking. Now it's starting to get a little bit harder. All right. First one, drag stop. Very easy. Off we go. Off you go. Play. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. Good. And relax. I'm just going to do a little test. Ready? You versus me, 1v1 on the line. Let's go. Leave the ball. So I've got the ball, you're the defender. Ready? Play. I love that skill. That's actually one I use a lot in a game. So. I've got two options with that. That's exactly the skill I've just done there. I can either go one, two, yeah? But you're very sharp. Normally when I do that with my clients, I just go like this, bang, bang. But you're a very good defender, very, very sharp. So I, what I did then, when I seen you move that way, I went that way. So this is why we repeat these skills. Because you're an attacking fullback, so you can use this type of stuff. I actually use it. All right. We're going to move on to the triple soul drag because you can do that one really well. <laughs> Have a look at this one. The more the more you move the ball, the better. This one's tough. Do I have to take my foot off every time? Or just keep... Only when you've done three. This. Good. It's like bending your knees, that left foot, that's all there is. So, be a little bit more delicate with it. One, nice and slow. Okay. Right, can you look at the iPad? So whenever you start to master a skill, yeah. eyes up, head up. Yeah. Good. Easy, synchronized, let's go, ready? Right foot first, we'll go on the inside. Three, two, one, play. Right, we'll one, two, one, two. Oh, hey, you're done. You're working a lot harder than me, you love that. Break, carry on. My is really slow. Alright. First, so we've got to try and combine some skills now, putting little combinations in, okay? What you're actually doing here, though, yeah, it's loads of different skills, loads of different combinations. But you're actually getting touches of the ball, you're working massively on your weak foot. I'm not saying you have to use these skills in a game, because some people choose not to. They just keep using the ones that are effective for them, i.e. Messi. You use the same skill every time and it'll work. That's fine, as long as it's effective. Neymar, on the other hand, we'll, we'll, you don't know what he's going to pull out the back. And that's why, that's why I really like him, because he's so unpredictable. Sometimes people know what Messi's going to do, but he's that sharp and getting past players, he's got no chance. It sounds to you if you want to use it, but what, what I really think we're working on here is your first touch, your dribbling, your skills, just brushing up on everything really, it's, it can be really effective, okay? With this one it's very simple, it's just one, two, now the foot that stops it, the opposite foot doesn't step over. One, two, three. One, two, three. Now I've got to make sure I step right over the ball, so when I stop it, I come right over the top of the ball. Okay, give that a go. Play. One, two, three. One, two, three. Good. 
Try not to go so far, because I want you to just go straight back into it. So try and give me five or six good ones here. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Good. Let's go two times. Ready? Start with the right foot drive. Good, three, two, one. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, Good. I'm just going to send you for a little drink. Come we'll get a quick one. I'm going to keep the camera rolling. For everyone that's watching on YouTube, um, uh, in terms of actually teaching these skills, if you notice, um, I'm, I'm counting the rhythm so she can get used to that rhythm. Um, if players struggle with a the rhythm, then it's very important that you count for them. I'm also jumping in as well and trying to do it synchronised so she can try and work at the same pace as me. If players struggle in terms of what part of the foot they want to use, then instead of counting the rhythm, I might actually say what part of the foot they should be using at that point. So I might go inside, outside, inside, or sole, 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 so then they can just start to pick it up. G back in. All right. Just a little bit, uh, slightly different. It's just a one, two, create the gap, three. One, two, plant, create the gap, three. Okay? Sole, inside, scissor. Sole, inside, scissor. Keep my balance, like bending my knee. Give that one practice. Play. One, two, ooh. Try and, try and just slap it with the sole, so it's inside of the foot to slap it. Play. One, two, Three. Good. One, two, three. Good. One, two, three. Good straight into it. One, two, three. So one, two, three. I'm trying to count a little bit quicker for you now. One. One, two, three. One, two, three. Good. One, two, three. I'm relaxed. How'd you find that one? A little bit harder because it's a rhythm. It's very important because I know that some of the a lot of my ball mastery requires a drag and stop in this video is uh, you've got to try your best to get it to stop if you move it this way it's going to put you off balance all right so we try that one synchronized start with the right foot we'll go slow start we ready one two three 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 one two good you see how um so yep. when I stop it, yes. plant that foot, yep. scissor, go now on, I'm using the momentum yep. for that to go straight go into the next that. one. Yeah, plant, you know I mean? scissor, momentum. Alright, just going to make it a little bit harder for you. Throw in a double scissor. So, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two. Didn't create the gap on that one there, see? And then I'm into it. Play. Right foot, left foot. Left foot, right foot. Right foot, left foot. Good. Nice. Nice, good. Set. Good, well done, relax. So much better, you're in a better set position there. Sheesh. I think we've just done the next one, let's see. Get Again, the likelihood of you using this in a game, never. Right? Just getting your brain to work with your feet, important. Alright? Do you know what? We'll do them next two. So those are the next two. It's starting to get really hard. This one's tough. Alright? Again, likelihood of using this in the game, very slim, but it's a good little uh, skill to practice, all right? It's one, two, three, set. One, two, three. Try not to let it catch your standing foot. One, two, three. So what I actually do is I stop it with the top of my laces. One, step over, two. That was a bad one because it didn't stop. Okay, play. Step over the ball. Drag, step over, stop. One, two, yeah. Again. Play. Yeah, good. Lucky. So that one there, 
that one there you've got to make sure you're taking a big step in front if I take that step in front I'm able to bring the following leg back good one two three good not so much of a drag one good again one two three yeah nice get that ball to stop if you can one two three oh yeah good close love to do this one thing right left side one make sure you get a feel for that ball first there we go good now set that's one straight into it two that's two in a row three in a row four in a row Oh, trying to use your right foot there, just go straight into it. Good, so where are you now? There, good. If the ball moves, just move with it. Nice. One, two, three. Nice, and relax. We're going to move on. Love that, dude. Good. Again, training the brain to work your feet. You probably won't use that in the game. This one, right? How do you do that? Good. Yeah, like a little fake pass. For all it is, you've got to roll your foot from one side to the other. Good set position. Bang, bang. Bang bang. For the reason being, if I'm against you now, I might want to get my body in and protect. Great little skill. You can use it, might do a fake pass and then go the opposite way. Okay? Practice that one for me. I do want to try and get it some synchronized too. I'm relaxed. So, just, uh, the standing foot stuck in the mud. So, if I'm here, watch my left foot, look where it moves to. So what you were doing then was, yeah, so it, it ends up crossing your legs over. Can you transfer your body? Ten. Move that right foot, okay? So you got boom, 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 good. Left side. One, two, three, good. Bang, bang, hold that. Bang, bang, good. Try and keep the side of your foot, push it back to stop. Much better, much better. Good. Straight into it. Good. One, two. I'm here for tech. Go. I'm here for tech. Body in. So I get that arm out as well. Go again. Right over the top of the ball. Play. I'm out for tech. Beautiful. So you got to make sure that ball stops. Try the other side. Play. Be a bit more natural on this side. Protect. I'm out. Good. Try and get that ball to stop again. Yeah. Love it. Love it. Right. I think it's Give me four or five in a row. Five. One, two, three, four, and relax. See if you can pick up any points from, from me, dude. Okay? Therefore, your foot's getting over quicker. Yeah, go again. Nice. And relax, good, yeah. So, with you doing it quicker, what do you think that's going to be? It's going to be more effective in the game. If I actually go like this, yes, Chief. Nah, but if I went, yes, Chief. I'm going to do you 100%. All right, next one. Last couple, and we're going to go over to finish. So, uh, what are we on now? Not even halfway through the video, so there's loads of other ones. I will keep it. Right. One, one's done. One, one's done. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what we're on now. Oh, no. Is it jump forward? Yeah. So now we're, we'll combine the two. Good. Good, and relax, good, get the ball. Balls in. That left side needs a lot more practice. This is actually quite tough, so we're combining ones that we've done before. So one, two, three, four. 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 Now, compared to what we've been doing at the start, this is a lot harder. 
Focus on drag stop, get a ball to stop first, play. Bang, 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 good. One, two, three, four, good. Now protect this next one from me, play. Drag, stop, protect, good, good. Yeah, opposite side, play. Drag, stop, protect, good, strong, strong, you gotta get that ball to stop. Play, try and give me five in a row, play. We'll do this together. Nice. One, two, three, four. All right, synchronized. Synchronized, ready? This might help you with the rhythm. Start with the solely foot. Three, two, one, play. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Ah, keep it going. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Ah! We were cooking then. We were cooking. Oh! Right. For some reason it stopped. Grab a drink, G. Hold on. Oh, we're going to end it there, guys. As you can see, when you work on ball mastery, it can be very tiring. So I wouldn't do it for the full hour. We've done it there for a good 30 minutes. I'm going to move on to something different for the end of George's um, session. She still needs a lot of work. We only got halfway through the video. So if you're watching my, if you've got this far yep. through our video, please click the subscribe button after this and thank you for watching.